All right. We've got a pipper here on the first clutch of the year. This pairing was a blackhead, black pastel, which I think might have Mojave in it. And the male was a phantom clown. I'll show you the mum. Uh, let's take this with this. So here's the mum. She's got a poop in there. Uh, so yeah, I got this as a blackhead, black pastel. I think it might have Mojave in it too. We'll see. Should hit some purple passions if there's Mojave in the pairing. The dad is right here. Looks like he's going into shed. All right, so let's see what we hit here. This head was out already. Looks very interesting. So let's uh, see what we got. I'm trying a new setup with the GoPro mounted on my head right now. So we'll start off with the pipper. This guy's already pipped so I'm not afraid to cut a decent size flap here. So that looks like a black pastel Mojave to me. So maybe we just proved out the Mojave. I don't know if we get you guys in closer there. What do you guys think? It looks black pastel Mojave to me. But we'll see what the other eggs have in them. Definitely feel the baby in there. These things are ready. So this girl, this clutch, no slugs, no bad eggs. It was all good. This was her first clutch, so. That looks interesting. Got some high flames on that bad boy. That looks like a black pastel phantom. Maybe. Definitely looks black pastel in there. Maybe this, maybe that's what that is, is Black Pestle Phantom, too, but they look a little different to me. That yellow dorsal makes me think Mojave, but see when they come out. I guess I'm getting a little upset with me. It's definitely a black head. That is a black head. That might be the three gene. That might be the black head, black pastel phantom. We'll see. This clutch pulled apart a couple days ago, um, but they were all set up how they laid. So I didn't pull them apart and, or anything like that. I just marked where the 
um, embryo was when I put them in the box so when they did pull apart it was easy to tell which way was up that looks like a blackhead black pastel or a blackhead phantom These are all going to be hit clowns, so that's awesome. These will be good babies for the uh, people wanting to get into the Pompeii project. Be black pastel hit clown combos. Oh, this baby's pushing back. Alright, looks like another black pastel. Whatever combo that is, that's a nice one. Black pastel. Phantom, maybe? Yeah, that looks Black Pastel Phantom, just like this one. That looks Black Pastel Mojave. So, a bit of a mystery. Actually, that might be a Blackhead Purple Passion. Interesting to see when it comes out. Here's the last egg. You can tell these were the eggs that were on the hot end of the incubator. Well, they were both on the end, so this egg was on one end, that egg was on the other one. When they pulled apart, I put all the, the eggs that were on the ends towards the front of the incubator, which is a little cooler. Moved all the other eggs closer to the back or the hotter, a little bit warmer end of the incubator. This egg's a little juicy. Right, and that looks like, that looks like another little black pastel. Mojave to me. It's got that really yellow dorsal. I don't know. It'll be interesting to see these ones come out. I'm not sure you can get much of a look there. I don't want to. I don't like to cut a huge gash in these ones. Just like to cut them and uh, so they can get out easily in case there's any egg tooth issues. All right, well, there's the clutch. Definitely a little bit of a head scratcher here with what we got. Cool to see them come out. That one. All right, so blackhead clutch is out and has shed out, so. This was Blackhead Black Pastel Female times Phantom Clown Male. So let's see how everything looks. All right, so. <clears throat> nice little box of treats here. All right, so we'll start off with this guy. This is a phantom hit clown. Uh, yeah, nice looking animals with crazy looking eye stripes. So you can see there, they connect right to the neck. It's pretty cool. So that is hit clown. I wrote down the sexes, what is that one? 
Uh, phantom. Female. Sweet. Uh, then we've got a black pastel here. That'll be head clown. It's a beauty. And that one is a male. So, anybody looking to get into the black pastel clown stuff? The, uh, what's it called? Um, Pompeii stuff. Would be a good male to have. Paired with your yellow belly head clown female. And we'll go on to this one. This is a phantom black pastel, and I actually like this combo a lot. It's got nice isolated alien heads, like maybe some ringer jean. It's got those faded out eye stripes. Very doing the ball python thing. Yeah, this this is a nice combo. Nice dash pattern down the back, a little bit of a ringer. And that one is a female. That'll be a nice female to have. Head clown. <clears throat> Then let's get into the blackhead stuff. So this one is this one keeps growing on me more and more. You can definitely tell the difference between the mystic and the phantom. And it's all just a matter of what you like more. I find the mystic is more black with no other tones. Whereas the Phantom, at least in this clutch, I haven't produced a lot of Phantom. Seems to have more of a yellow undertone. So, very similar to what you see with the uh, Butter and Lesser. But this thing is awesome. I have the same combo, but it's possible Het Lav instead of Het Clown. And this one looks awesome There's a bit of a head stamp there look at that ringer this one's this clutch was throwing ringers so that's pretty cool look at all those isolated alien heads maybe some ringer gene in there I don't think it's got red gene I have another line of blackhead that has definitely has red gene and it's quite looks quite a bit different than this blackhead line. Not crazy different, but you can tell the difference. And we'll go to Oh, this guy is a male. Then we've got a blackhead, black pastel. And one thing I find with the blackheads is it takes a while for their colors to come in, they gotta grow a bit. And I think that's definitely gonna be true with this because um, the female that produces clutch is this combo and it is dark. This looks more silvery, but I think it'll darken up quite a bit as it ages and those side patterns start coming out real nice. Uh, got a nice stripe down the back, just like mom. And yeah, this one is actually a male. I was going to keep this one, but I've now gone towards... I've got these both up for grabs. Whichever one sells, I'm keeping the other one. Because I'd probably be happy with either one of them. And then... The big one, the three-gener. I actually think this looks better without the phantom gene in it. This one is a blackhead black pastel phantom. And I prefer how the blackhead black pastel looks on its own. And I prefer how the blackhead phantom looks on its own. Mix them all together. This is kind of muddled. Um, 
hopefully as it grows some of the side pattern will come in but genetically this animal is a powerhouse this one's a female it's staying right here and uh, yeah but I'll probably take it I don't know I'll have to think about which direction I want to take it but I want to get pattern back in this I don't want it to be muddled out like this because I have seen blackhead phantom cinnamon clown visual clown and it doesn't look a whole lot different than this actually uh, so it's not it's a little bit of a disappointment when you get these awesome powerful dunes together and they come out kind of muddled but yeah that's why I think I'm gonna go different direction but definitely still going for the blackhead clown stuff so yeah if anybody has any questions about any of this hit me up uh, these are awesome group of animals I'm very happy with how this clutch turned out and uh, yeah, get at me. I can ship anywhere in Canada. I can ship to the US. Obviously it'll be a little bit more pricey. But yeah, get at me. These won't last long. All right, hope you all enjoyed that. This is going from the cutting to post shed. It's a long process, man. All right, well, everybody have fun out there. See ya.